They're fabulous, huh? Fabulous dancers. What do you think of the festival? It's lovely. I didn't know it was going on today, so it's a nice surprise, and it's nice from kind of little two-dimensional world we live in here to have some difference. Ooh, we got you food grill. Healthy, but tasty. What do you got going over here? This is uh, our straw vanilla smoothie. It's uh, strawberries, bananas, 100% apple juice, and low-fat yogurt. Oh. Mmm. You'd never know it. It's delish. I, I really believe that these kind of festivals are something very important for the community. They bridge the gap. In fact, I do uh, another festival that is called the Latin American Family Festival along the same philosophy. So I think it's wonderful. The art is beautiful. Woo, we got lots of stuff here. What do you got going over here? Uh, we got meatball sandwiches and sauces, peppers, and onion subs going on here. You sound like you might have some experience. Maybe Italian, East Coast. You make the good stuff? A lot of Italian. North Jersey. Uh, we got a place on the East Trail, Vino's Pizzeria. A lot of nice stuff, a lot of good food. So you make the real stuff? This is the real McCoy. No fake here. Philly steaks, good stuff. We don't just have food here today. We've even got apartment complex represented. And, and what, do you, what do you got going here? Lots of stuff on your table. Apartment, uh, it's a uh, Whistler's Green apartment. And when you move in, you can get a 32 TV. We move in or a Wii. And this is our first year here, and it's great. We invite other people to come in. And All right. Thank you. Looks like you got a lot going on your table, too. Lots of giveaways. Yes, we do. That's the way to get them over. We've got more than 50 restaurants, community organizations, good food, and lots to do here at the festival. And we are having a great time.
Who are you out here today? Uh, I'm with Color School of the Arts, and we uh, perform earlier uh, this morning. What do you think of the festival? I think it's wonderful. You know, this is the second year, but this is my first year coming, and I am having a ball. What's your favorite thing, or what do you like most about it? Um, the diversity, um, all of the different ethnic and cultural dances, and uh, the different foods, the art, just everything. It's absolutely wonderful. It's really important to influence our children, the, the next generation, the next, the future leaders, to influence them in appreciation of different cultures. You break down those walls, you build up confidence and trust in one another. And that's really so vitally important, especially in today's world, that, that we, we hold the walls down and, and open up dialogue with different cultures. And just, it's all about appreciation appreciating the the fact that this person is different from me but in that difference I can learn something and maybe something that will benefit me and make my life better and, and, and our kids need to learn that. You're with the missing, the National Center for Missing and Exploited Children, and what made you want to come out to this event? To bring awareness to families and children that because we've got two children missing right now in our backyards, that it's more important than ever to follow the safety rules. That uh, you just don't walk away from the house without a friend. You don't walk away from the house without being able to ask mom, okay. And I think more parents today are talking about safety than ever before. Hi, what are you doing today? Oh, uh, good. I'm going to hear my mom say, and I'm going to talk about her friend, Alice. Yeah, thank you, Mom. <laughs> Mommy. Are you having fun? Yes. A1A Amusement was just one of the companies here making sure that the kids had a blast. What you doing back there? I'm really excited to go uh, in the fire truck. I went in there and I want to go in there again. I'm here with Jerry Welty of the American Red Cross, one of the main sponsors of this event. Jerry, tell me, why did it, the American Red Cross think it was important to be involved in this event? Well, we've been doing this event ever since it started, and we feel like it's a great opportunity to get all the diverse groups of Cuyahoga County together, and it certainly goes along with the Red Cross role of impartiality and diversity and all the things that the Red Cross stands for. Come together and be friends and not separate from different cultures. What's your favorite thing you're doing today? Dancing. What else have you what have you been doing all day long at the festival? Oh. Watching dances and eating.